Kamanzi Innocent lost four members of his family among a crowd of Tutsis killed by Hutus during the Rwandan genocide of 1994. Hutu militia lobbed grenades into a church where they were sheltering, then doused it with fuel and tried to set it ablaze. When that failed, they knocked down the church with bulldozers, killing some 2,000 people sheltering inside. After two decades on the run, one of the genocide's most wanted suspects was arrested in South Africa on Wednesday. Fulgence Kayashema is now subject to an extradition request from Rwanda. Accused of ordering the death of 2,000 people hiding in the church, Kayashema appeared in court briefly on Friday to deny any involvement, but said he was sorry for the killings. Back in Rwanda, Innocent says he knows the accused. He said the two grew up in the same village and went to the same high school. The day after Kayashema appeared in the South African court, Innocent visited the memorial site where his family died. Their bodies were mixed with the soil and the remains of the church, he said, and we put the remains here for everyone to see. An estimated 800,000 ethnic Tutsis and Hutu moderates were killed during Rwanda's genocide, orchestrated by an extremist Hutu regime almost 30 years ago.